Hello Libra, it's Milady from Milady's Way Tarot and I'm coming to do your weekly general reading in the week of June 20th through the 27th, 2022. The cards I'm using today are hmm, Fairy Lenormand Oracle cards by David, nope, by Marcus Katz and Tally Goodwin. And I'm closing off with my Tarot Dragonis by David Corsi. I want to thank everybody for like, sharing, subscribing, and setting up personal readings with me. All right, more foes. Let's get this show on the road. All right, what's going on with the Libra? Libra, Libra, Libra. What's going on? What's going on? What's going on? All right, so we got card number 23 here. So it looks like somebody's doing a little bit of sneaking around, okay? Somebody is being a little sneaky, little snake. Um, I do feel like this could be you doing that um, or somebody could be doing this to you, okay? I do feel like some kind of, somebody may be just like skimming off the top. Um, it could be some kind of, yeah, somebody's just taking something, taking things that, that aren't there, okay? Definitely some kind of loss coming or on the way, okay? But I feel like it's due to theft, okay? All right, so I do feel like some kind of offer is getting ready to come in. I feel like, of course, this is some type of uh, new beginning happening, okay? New beginning, new things going on, or new things coming, okay? Hmm. Something new is on the way. I do feel like somebody may try to take it from you. All right, so we got, or you could be trying to take something from somebody else. So we have the, what is this? Number two. Okay, so this is about somebody getting lucky or somebody um, receiving some kind of money bonus or some type of gift. Okay. Mm. Okay. Now, somebody might have received something and somebody stole it or somebody stole something um, and kept it for themselves. Okay, that's their gift. Okay, but I do feel like um, something was supposed to be for somebody else, but I do feel like it was lost somehow and given to somebody else. All right, so we got card number four here. Oh, wow. So this makes me feel like... Uh, it could have been a relationship, but this also could be a um, a job. I feel like somebody may have stole somebody partner or stole somebody position, okay? Um, I feel like it's stole because I feel like somebody may have just been doing a lot of little sneaky stuff to make it harder for someone or... Um, Yeah, sneaky stuff to make it harder for somebody or uh, just basically just setting them up, okay? A lot of set, setting up going on here, okay? Whether it's a relationship or job. I was doing stuff to make somebody not want that person so I look better, okay? All right, so we got card number five here. So I do feel like um, somebody is trying to choose who's going to be the foundation of this family, of this job, of this um, place, okay, of, of whatever's going on. Mm -hmm. Somebody trying to sabotage the, the next picks, okay, sabotage the position. All right, so we got the six of hearts here, so I do feel like whatever this is, is going to happen um, sooner than later, uh, but I also feel like Whoever doing this setting up is going to work, okay? The person is doing all the setting up and the sneaky business is going to get what they're asking for, okay? Get what they're looking for. If they want somebody to leave, they're going to get somebody to leave. If they want to steal somebody's position, they're going to be able to steal somebody's position. Wow. All right, so we got card number 34 here. So I do feel like some kind of new beginning. I do feel like for some of us, it just may be a pregnancy or something that's going to help 
steal the position, okay? All right, so we got card number 13 here. So I do feel like somebody, of course, is acting like innocent, acting like they are the victim or they are, um, what you call that? You know, they didn't have anything to do with all the weird stuff that's going on. But, of course, they were they were the, the reason of everything. Okay, they started everything. They, oh, my goodness. They the one that set you up, okay? But they acting like, oh, my God, I don't know. I don't know what happened. I don't know what's wrong. Set you up and didn't tell on you right away. No, you're going to run into the trap. Like somebody say they, they threw away all the uh, deposit slips and, and then act like you didn't order any. Okay. Or act like, you know, you just did. They disappeared because of you. Okay. Act like you may have taken them or something. Like had the keys and act like you, you lost them or took them home or something. All right, so there we go. That go the death card. Okay, so some kind of ending, some kind of transition, um, tra some kind of reforming is happening. Okay. All right, so we got the ten of cups here. So I do feel like family's getting ready to come together. Hopefully, it ain't gonna be no crazy stuff. Hopefully, it ain't gonna be no getting together to throw them things. <laughs> okay. All right. Oh, wow. So we got the Page of Pentacles reversed here. So I do feel like, yeah, somebody is getting ready to lose their job or have to come out of a lot of money because of whatever this is that is lost. Okay. Somebody going to have to pay for that. All right. So we got the Nine of Cups reversed. So this makes me feel like this is the other side. Of course, somebody is not happy with what's going on. Okay. This is not what was supposed to happen. I didn't do anything wrong. Okay. All right. So what's going on with this 10 of cups one card, please. All right. So we got the king of coins here. So it's like, I do feel like um, somebody is getting back closer to their family, but I do feel like the family might be helping you pay somebody because this person is like no matter if you leave or not i'm i need my money first okay so you paying for something that somebody else has messed up somebody else did and i do feel like it was a promotion or marriage or something else coming up because of that i feel like it's not happening because that trust level has went down and then you've seen that this person that you're dealing with only cares about money they don't care about feelings or people it's all about money all right, so we got the five of pentacles reversed. So I do feel like, um, yeah, somebody is doing a lot of saving up, okay? Or somebody's just taking a lot of time to try to pay close attention to what they're doing. Because I feel like somebody a little bit know they was set up, but I feel like a little bit they kind of say like, okay, maybe I wasn't. Yeah, somebody was definitely set up here. But it looked like somebody is paying the fee. So we got the Eight of Pentacles reversed here. So I do feel like after this whole situation, somebody is just losing care, losing hope in, t in this relationship anyway. Um, and I do feel like somebody's ready to walk away. It's just like, it's not worth it anymore. It's not like I don't care that much about it anymore after all this. Okay, I see how people really think. This is another reason why somebody don't care. It's like, I'm tired of fighting against everybody. Okay, I'm tired of... All these people after me trying to figure out what I'm doing, trying to set me up. This is just too much for me. And I do feel like somebody is just done with that. It's not It's not worth it. Okay, let's see what this is. All right, so we got the Queen of Coins and we have the Tower Reverse. So I do feel like this is the person that won. Okay, this is the person that do the set, did the setting up. This is not the first time this person has set somebody up to get somebody back. That's crazy because I just saw a picture of a baby a lady with a baby so i could be a, a child's mom or a child's dad doing some setting up to get them to leave the person that they dealing with okay um i've got the tower card so it looked like somebody's getting ready to rebuild their self after they get rid of this person as well it's making me look good to get all these people out okay but other than that that's all i have for you guys make sure to check your sun moon and rising signs thanks for watching